Hello, and welcome back to Chris's Drunk Suppers, part three. Right, I weren't doing a video tonight, but I spent three hours trying to fix my PlayStation, and I've had a few beers while doing it. I've given up, it's fuck, right? So I thought I'd decide I'll do a drunk supper, because let's face it, I'm pretty fucking monty right now, right? So... I've got bits and bobs lying around, got some potatoes, I've got some beans, got some bacon, uh, I've got some spicy paprika, you know, bits and bats. So I thought I'd do my own drunk cowboy. going to start this I'm not 100% sure all I do though is a good glug of rapeseed oil you know what I swear by it it's half the saturated fat of olive oil and I'll drink it by the fucking gallon so the oil in that pan is leaping I've got some chopped potatoes I'm going to start frying shit off, you right? First of all, I'm going to start by, I want to get these crisped off a little bit. This might take me three or four minutes or so. Just keep moving them around. Keep agitating them. I'd add some salt, but I'm not. But I'll tell you what I am doing. I'm going to add some bit of pepper. And the reason I'm not adding salt is because I've got about three pounds of fucking bacon to go in here, yeah? So okay, I'll carry on doing this and then uh, have another beer because it'd be rude not to and then we'll be back. Potatoes have crisped up nicely. We're going to go in with our fucking 17 pound of bacon then. Just keep, keep moving that as well because it's all clumped in pieces. So I want it to you know, separate a little bit. So it's like before. I'll carry on here, open yet another can of Stella, and I'll be back with you. And I think at this point, I am going to put two garlic cloves chopped in as well. Because we fucking love garlic in this house. Now it's time to throw our red onion in. Now there's a really, really good reason why I'm using red onion. And uh, that's because that's all I had fucking left, I'll be honest. So yay! We'll let that sweat down a bit and we'll crack on. So I now have that where I want it. There. I've got a kettle of hot water. And I'm just going to cover it. There you go. If you use that water, you don't have to wait. You don't have to wait as long for it to come back to the fucking pile, do you? I'm going to give it a quick stir. Right. Listen, I'm going to leave that now for another couple of minutes. Let it get bubbling like fuck. And uh, ugh, I'll be putting the mince in. Like Kate's cooking, I'm going to buy all this mince for about three fucking decades. So, brothers and sisters, I've got that boiling again. So I'm going to add my mince. Mince I got from work. It's a 90% BL mince. But I'm going to have to spend a few minutes just crushing this up and getting it in there. And get it so it's not all big clumps of fucking meatballs and fucking meatloaf and stuff like that, is it? Just keep stirring it, keep agitating it. Listen, you don't want to stand there all night watching me fucking mince, do you? 
Oh, on that note, I'll uh, I'll see you in a little while. So we got that bubbling nicely. So now I'm going to go in with a tin of beans. This is the only thing, right, that's of any volume going in here now. Otherwise, I'm running the risk of going over the fucking edges. I've only got one tin, which I'm gutted about. I should have had two tins. But that's it. I've got one tin. It's got lost in there. But at least we've got some beans in there, right? And now I'm going to go in with a no stop pop. And there we are. Plop. Drop the kids off at the pool. So I'm going to keep stirring this so that, that stop pot dissolves and basically develops a gravy. I wasn't happy with the amount of beans in there because I only had one tin. So I'm going to go in with a tin of Heinz spaghetti hoops as well. Uh, get out of your twat. There we are. They're all like... That's it, I'm putting nothing else in there now that's going to add any volume to this pan. Because we are literally, literally, about about five millilitres, millimetres, 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 you know what I'm saying, off the, going over the edge and causing a fucking disaster. Now, that is bubbling like molten lava. And that's how we like it. So now I'm going to start adding my couple of spices. And the first one is Tabasco Smoky Chipotle. Or Chipotle. Chipotle. It depends what part of the country you come from. So we're going to have a good glug of that. And I mean a fucking good glug. There you go. This is probably a lot of the ball now. And then we're going to go in with our spicy paprika. And just stir it. I've lost my wooden spoon again. Oh, well, I don't know it for two minutes ago. And I would give that a good stir. So that should have a really, really good kick to it. I've not added any salt because there's that much fucking bacon in there. You know what I mean? It, you know what I mean? The, the bacon. If I put any more salt in that. It'd be like, you know what I mean? Mouth would be like Gandhi's fucking flip flop. I thought I'd add some ash browns as well. Because I'm that kind of guy. I'm kind of making a well. Cowboys must have had ash browns at some point. Where, where, did, where did fucking ash browns come from? That's what I want to know. Apart from fucking potatoes. Right, so we're going to put our fucking cowboy slop in the middle of there. Uh, I'm making a right fucking mess. But hey. That's because I'm fucking absolutely wankered. So we'll leave it at that for a second. I'll clean this shit up. Oh hang on, no. We have finished. We have not finished. I'm going to put on. Some bullseye trap. Bullseye trappy. Trappy, what the fuck am I? New York Steakhouse barbecue sauce. Right, because there must have been some fucking cowboys in New York at some point, wasn't there? This stuff is fabulous, by the way. Smack bang in the middle. Look at that. That is my drunk supper, part three. So I'll clean it up, take my thumbnail, uh, probably have another Stella, because I've not had three gallon yet. And uh, I'll slide it down me gizzard. Right, let's slide this down me gizzard. Got me ash browns. I love ash browns. So we'll get some of that. Some of that, some of that, that barbecue sauce. Because that is a cracking barbecue sauce, you know. Oh, yeah. Mm. Tell you what now. That is going to be a proper cowboy. Do you know why? Because it's going to give me fucking heartburn. And it's going to make me fucking fat like fuck. 
Right, brothers and sisters, I want to thank you for stopping by. I'll tell you what I caught, but I can't remember. It was a cowboy thing, I can't remember what I put in it because I'm not fucking drunk. I don't know. It's a drunk supper, isn't it? So that's, that's all you need to know. But if you like it, press like, comment, tell me what a fucking lush I am. And, uh, yeah, oh yeah. Oh, share, yeah. I always forget about fucking that sharing shit. Let the share, you're not going to get anywhere, are you? Uh, Lucy looks as rough as I do. Right? Oh, yeah. And subscribe. I'll become a family member of Hashtag Team CTB. With me, Lucy. <laughs> you brothers and sisters, I'm drunk as fuck. And I'll see you again. Because I will see you because I fucking love you.